For the experts monitoring Asian carp's slow progression towards the lakes and rivers in our area, last week's discovery of the invasive species DNA in the Maumee leads to more questions than answers. All that a positive eDNA test says is that there was Asian carp DNA in the water, and there is still some question as to what that means. Does it mean that there was a live fish um, or not? Dr. Carol Stepien is the director of the Lake Erie Center. She believes that some Asian carp are probably already here. The task for scientists is to halt a mass migration to our waters before it's too late. That they're very dangerous for our ecosystem. I think if enough of them get here, in Maumee Bay, they will probably love it. Scientists are especially worried about the Asian carp's effect on the food chain, which could lead to the demise of the seafood that attracts thousands of people to the Maumee each summer. Asian carp feed at the lowest uh, food level, and what they do is they, they have the potential to outcompete um, bait fish that are important for um, our Great Lakes sport fisheries like walleye and yellow perch in Lake Erie, for example. Over the last several years, scientists have used electric fences and watersheds and poison to try to halt the progression of the fish with limited success. You know, really it's only a matter of time before they get in unless we uh, start acting seriously to prevent them.